In this video you will learn how to create views and sections from your three-dimensional models. Let's start by setting drawing files 141 through 147 to the open and edit mode status and drawing file 148 to the active status. Now we can start generating views of our building. Select the Generate View command. We can then adjust the settings for our view and place it in the active drawing file. Check that the Update Automatically setting is enabled for our new view. With the Generate View command, we can create planned views, elevations, and isometric or perspective views. Use the track lines to neatly arrange views. You can also adjust the anchor point for views in the Generate View palette. Because our views were set to update automatically, any changes that we make to our model will immediately appear in our views. We can also change the model by modifying objects that appear in our views. Let's now create some basic horizontal and vertical sections. We can also create sections from views or other sections. Views can be generated directly into the drawing files under the derived from building structure. Simply right-click on one of these drawing files and then select Generate View. 
Just like earlier, we can adjust the properties and appearance of the view before it is generated and placed into the drawing file. You can view any of your sections in three dimensions using the animation window. To create isometric sections, we'll need to keep the animation window open. First, orient your model in the animation window to the direction you'd like to see it in your section. Now we'll switch back to the viewport showing the floor plan and start the generate section command. This time set the input to advanced and the input options to free. Now draw the clipping line to indicate the extents of the section. Instead of selecting the direction for our section in this viewport, simply click into the animation window. Again, you can modify the properties and appearance of the section before placing it into your drawing.